Samsung has officially confirmed that its Galaxy Unpacked 2025 event will be held on the 9th of July in Brooklyn, New York, starting at 10 a.m. ET, 7.30 p.m. IST. During this event, the company is expected to introduce its next-generation foldable smartphones, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Galaxy Z Flip 7, both of which will feature a new AI-driven interface. The event will be broadcast live on Samsung's official website and YouTube channel. Samsung is highlighting the launch of next-generation Galaxy devices equipped with advanced hardware designed to fully support the capabilities of its Galaxy AI platform. According to the company, this marks a shift from reaction to anticipation, positioning smartphones as intelligent tools that not only respond to user input but also anticipate needs and act proactively in real time. What you're looking at right now aren't just concept renders or AI mockups. These are physical dummy units of the Galaxy Z Fold 7, spotted online, giving us our clearest look yet at what Samsung's next-gen foldable will look like. And let me tell you, this device means business. These dummy units available in both pearl white and jet black don't power on, don't carry the Samsung logo, and don't run software. But for design enthusiasts and tech nerds, they give us something even more valuable. A first-hand look at the refined, ultra-premium build language of the Fold 7. The Fold 7 is Samsung's thinnest foldable ever. When fully unfolded, the body reportedly measures even slimmer than the already razor-thin Fold SE at 4.9 mm. That's paper-thin territory. And this new slim profile enhances both aesthetics and portability without compromising that signature book-style fold. Flip it over, and the triple camera array immediately grabs attention. Unlike last year's flatter design, the Fold 7's camera bump is massive clearly sticking out more than its predecessors. That's the trade-off when you chase ultra-slim profiles. There's simply no room to hide big sensors flush inside the body. Each lens is neatly aligned in a vertical row, housed in a sleek metallic frame. Right next to it, a single LED flash. On the front, the cover screen looks noticeably wider, with narrower bezels hugging the display. This should dramatically improve usability, especially for one-handed tasks. The dummy confirms what the rumors hinted at. Samsung has refined the outer display's aspect ratio, making it less narrow and more natural to use. Everything from the clean edges to the flat back panel screams minimalism and modernity. So far, we've seen white and black dummy units. The white version pops with a clean matte finish that complements the dark camera lenses, while the black version looks stealthy and sleek perfect for those who love that all-black everything aesthetic. There's also a silver variant rumored to be in the pipeline, possibly similar to last year's Fold 6. A recent leak from Android Headlines gave us our first look at two potential color options for the upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 7, Jet Black, and Blue Shadow. These appeared to be official renders, offering an early glimpse into Samsung's design choices. But that's not all, there's now a third color option in the mix. An internal source, who wishes to remain anonymous, has revealed what looks like a sleek silver finish. This new shade closely resembles the one seen on last year's Galaxy Z Fold 6, adding a touch of familiarity to the lineup. Alongside this, we've also received an image of an internal ribbon cable. This component plays a key role in the phone's internal design, linking the motherboard where the SoC and camera modules are usually placed to a daughter board, which generally houses the lower speaker and microphone. The photo also confirms the presence of a USB-C connector, a standard feature for Samsung's foldables. Printed on the ribbon are several regional identifiers North America, Europe, China, Korea, and global hinting at wide-scale international distribution. The model number for the Galaxy Z Fold 7 is listed as SMF966, aligning with Samsung's naming conventions for the series. Here, we have the first official CAD-based renders of the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 7. Today's renders, courtesy of OnLeaks and Android headlines, reveal what looks like a steady evolution in Samsung Z series foldables until you view it from the side. While the exact thickness of the Z Fold 7 remains unconfirmed, it clearly looks thinner than its 12.1mm predecessor. Though direct comparisons are tough without handling the device, earlier reports suggested a 3.9mm thickness when unfolded even slimmer than last year's region-specific Galaxy Z Fold SE, and this model could follow suit. Apart from the new form factor, what really stands out is the striking new blue finish. While the black option is standard for Samsung, this metallic blue shadow color offers a refreshing burst of vibrancy something that feels timely. After years of focusing on more subdued tones like silver, white, and black, it's a welcome shift to see a bold, saturated color featured on one of Samsung's flagship foldables. According to Android headlines, more color variants are also expected. Whatever the precise measurements, the prominently raised camera lens makes one thing evident. This is Samsung's slimmest and most modern foldable yet. That could help explain the company's early teasers hinting at an ultra-level experience earlier this month. Beyond the reduced thickness, the device also appears wider, more in line with competing foldables from brands like Google and OnePlus. 
And once again, Samsung has teased the device on its official platform, confirming significant updates for this latest foldable. Recently, several new teasers for the Z Fold 7 have been released by Samsung, including a poster that showcases the updated design of the phone. In their latest promotional effort, Samsung dropped another teaser in collaboration with a popular K-pop group, the entire group got the chance to see and use the Galaxy Z Fold 7, and their individual reactions stood out each member responded in a unique way. This teaser runs for about 31 seconds and features the device presented inside a large box. The first response was super sleek. Another one said, it's incredibly thin. Another one shared, it's beyond my expectations. Even one of them said, I want to switch mine right now. So these were some of the remarks from Grub. Earlier reports had already suggested that the Galaxy Z Fold 7 could be the thinnest foldable phone ever made though it seems the design includes a noticeably large camera bump. Recently surfaced images of the Galaxy Z Fold 7 in a protective case provide a closer look at the device's rear camera setup. The phone appears to feature a significantly pronounced, double-sized camera bump relative to its sleek frame. The vertically aligned camera module houses three distinct camera rings. The main reason for this prominent bump is likely the inclusion of a 200-megapixel primary sensor with a 1 over 1.4-inch size. In addition to the main camera, the device is expected to feature a 12-megapixel ultrawide lens and a 10-megapixel telephoto unit, offering 3x optical zoom along with optical image stabilization. There is speculation that the ultrawide camera could support autofocus, similar to what's seen on the Galaxy S25 Edge, although this hasn't been confirmed. The device is also said to include an upgraded under-display front camera and a 10-megapixel selfie camera on the cover display. Samsung has kicked off its teaser campaign for the Galaxy Z Fold 7, and the company is now offering the first look at upcoming camera improvements for its latest foldable device. The Z Fold 7 will feature a more advanced multimodal AI search built directly into the Galaxy camera app. This appears to be a new in-house feature powered by Galaxy AI. According to Samsung, the camera will be capable of understanding what it sees and reacting accordingly. The latest teaser also includes the familiar Ultra Experience tagline consistent with the previous two teasers. In the lead-up to their official launch, numerous details about these foldable devices have surfaced, including information about their processors. Now new details regarding the Galaxy Z Fold 7's wireless charging capabilities have emerged linked to its recent appearance in the QA 2.10 certification database. An unreleased Samsung device carrying the model number SMD637 U was recently spotted in the Wireless Power Consortium, WPC database, as reported by 9to5Google. While Samsung typically does not use SMDXX format for phone model numbers, it previously used SMD617D to mask the Galaxy Z Fold 5's model number, SMF946B. Based on that precedent, SMD637U is likely a placeholder for SMF967U, which corresponds to the carrier-locked US version of the Galaxy Z Fold 7. According to the listing, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 includes Kai 2.0 certification. This makes it Samsung's first foldable device to receive the Key 2 Ready designation. The phone will require cases equipped with integrated magnets to support the magnetic power profile MPP. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button below. Peace out.